Hey, what's going on guys? Zip here. And welcome back to Monster School. It's been a little bit since I've been in class. But I don't want to be late because apparently there are some new students today. Henzoid knows and they happen to be really close. And Henzoid, by the way, is a real close friend of mine. So you should check out his channels. Link in the description of today's video. As well as our old superintendent, Mr. Goretto, who helped found the Monster School. With that, though, I think I see one of the first new students. Holy moly, what are you... Oh, oh, the professor. Oh, Tyler, you're actually early for once. Well, take a seat and we'll get started shortly. Well, first of all, <laughs> let's look at some of these new students. Hey, we've got Vinny the Vindicator. Isabel the Illusioner, I guess. Isabel, you're looking a little thin today. I can see right through you. Someone get her a chocolate milk stat. We have ourselves Rex. Ooh, yo, you're scary looking. And your parents aren't that creative. Rex, the Vex, come on, seriously? You got candles on your desk? Oh, everyone's got candles on their desk. Looks like we've seen some serious <laughs> renovations here. Buddy, I am here, huh? You didn't get some reading in? Yeah, no kidding. I, I don't blame you. Look how long those arms are. It's perfect for holding up books. We've got Spider, Spider, sure. Skellington, naturally. Someone, is that my seat? That must be my seat, okay. Well, we've got Zombie. Mm hmm Sylvester, yes. Zombie Swine, Mucus, Wilton, mm -hmm, yes, we've got all of our old students. Only a couple new ones. Uh I guess it's better that we go ahead and just take our seat, huh? Whoa, he what do you what do you want a hug or something? It's kinda weird. Anyway, let's take our seat already and see what today's all about. Iron Man whispers to Rex. Don't tell anyone. I stole that nerd Tyler's books. Rex Iron Man, how the teacher got You stole my books? Ah, Hero Brian's already talking. You two, what are you whispering about back there? Nothing, Mr. Hero Brian, they say. Yeah, okay. Good. Because the school year just started again recently and everyone should have a new set of textbooks. Does everyone have their Well, I don't have my textbooks. Where are my textbooks? Mm, yeah, you would giggle, wouldn't you guys? Ugh, whatever he says. I know we have got copies in the school. Here's a hall pass. Go to the library. See if they have the four textbooks you need. Yeah, Hero Brian, they took my teacher. Oh, they took all my books. Normally, I'd be pretty excited about it, to be perfectly honest with you. There's a lot of reading. Knowledge is power. They, that's what they say. But what's honestly as powerful as having a nice, clean desk. Meanwhile, look at this mess over here. Jeez. Look like the Harry Potter series on his desk or something. Anyways, we need a math textbook, a grammar textbook, a history textbook, and the monster manual. Yeah, 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 I suppose. So let's head to the library. Maybe we can get ourselves something special. We got our hall pass right here. Looking real good. Thank you, teacher, for excusing me. And keep an eye out for Iamir and Rex over there. They've been causing lots of problems, teacher, okay? I'm just, I'm not a teacher's pet, okay? I just, I, I want to learn in peace. Anyways, take the hall pass. In we go. Beautiful. Thank you so much. Principal's office. Not bad. Yo, who's it? Cards, you're here to level five. We, I, I, well, <laughs> I guess I don't really want to see the principal anyways. Now, we're supposed to head to the library, but I did just get a free hall pass. Maybe we should explore around a little bit. Looks like there's some new staff as well. Linda the librarian. Hello, Tyler. Come to get your textbooks, I see. Well, you're in luck. The library has plenty of copies of your math, English, and history textbooks. Interesting. But no monster manual, huh? It says right there, though. I would check with the coach in the gym. He said he knows where there were more monster manuals. Well, thanks, Linda. You might want to do something about that wart on your nose, by the way. It's gross. So, math textbook. Okay, we've got math and grammar here. Oh, boy. Math textbook. Perfect. There's our first. That's a pretty good grab. Actually, looking at it, don't we need, we need an English book, too? And we need a history book. Well, here's history. Hmm, interesting. There we go. Well, that was not bad, man. The English and history. Done deal. Thanks, Linda. I didn't even mean to come in here. I was trying to be a truant and uh, look around a little bit. Principal. Don't want him to know anything, huh? What do we have? The teacher's lounge keypad um zero 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 that should do it zero zero it's it's not working what <laughs> whatever school gymnasium oh not bad yo this place is huge the renovations are crazy right now and here's our teacher mr coach scores coach scores really this is my this is my teacher okay whatever <laughs> what up coach so you want to know about some nerdy book huh well, I ain't saying nothing until you show me you've been practicing your jumping skills. Go complete the training course up by them bleachers, and then I'll help you with your nerds. Oh, wow, mean guy. Well, Coach Scores, what are you going to do if I ride on you? Oh, okay, it doesn't let me. Well, that, that was weird. Complete the training, huh? Training. Oh, is this it? Training room. Yeah, this is the training. Ah, I see. So we need to do a little bit of parkour. Mm -hmm. 
Yo, the budget for school has gone up crazy. Seriously though, there's no safety precautions in here. What if I fall and hurt myself? <laughs> They'd probably be all about it, huh? Yeah, well, don't ask you guys anyways. Get up to I need to brush up on my parkour skills. Come on. There we go, baby. That only took 10 billion years. Now I'm gonna jump to this one. Oh boy. I I, I tell you. Yeah, okay, that one not bad. Oh my gosh, it just gets worse and worse. Eh. Almost there, almost there. Eh. Oh my gosh, we're doing it. We're so close. Please. Please! Oh no! Hey, we made it. Don't worry about it, okay? There's the training course. Completed. Now, scores. Give me what I want. Which is the uh, books. <laughs> you got some books for me, mister? Please, tell me. Yes. Okay, okay, I'll tell you this much. I don't have no book, but the sub in the teacher's lounge might know a thing or two. The password to get in is hidden somewhere in the library. Oh, I gotta go back to the library with this game playing. Look at Isabel causing problems. Can't you just turn into a normal... Not see-through person, please. I don't have to look around and see you everywhere I go. Sorry, I'm in bad mood. All right, Linda, I ain't playing these games anymore. Can you get me what I need? <laughs> Linda! Oh, it's, I'm sorry, Linda. I didn't... Whoa, look at that nose. You got, you got a serious nose on you. Thing's got a mind of its own. Well, these are all the study books. Fiction, 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 fiction. Everything's fiction. <laughs> Maybe we can get something decent? Moon Secrets. That sounds exciting. But none of these are that helpful. Whispering Years by Kate. A classic, truly. One of the most amazing authors of our time. <laughs> Something like that. Teacher's Lounge. Oh, here we go. That's perfect. All right. 64032. Well, don't mind if I do hoo-hoo. 64032. The deed is done. We're in. Oh. Oh. Hey, it's the superintendent, I think, right? Professor Weatherman. You again? Well, good luck finding the key to the principal's office. That shelf has so many key cards, I can't even find one to my own classroom. Wow, you're, uh, you're getting a lot of key cards. But you do have six eyes, so it shouldn't take you that much longer, should it? All right, all right, I'll look. Well, I guess our best bet's gonna be to slowly start grabbing hall pass. Okay, we got the cafeteria card. We got another cafeteria. How many of these are we gonna get? Basement card. Totally useless card. You got a totally useless card on your wall? Seriously, Professor. You'd think with all those eyes, you'd know exactly what to be placing, but I suppose not. Witherman's room card. Is that the one we need? No, we need the principal's card. That's not the right one. Oh boy, I'm gonna be here forever. Another Witherman's room card. Can we get some help, please? Jeez. It's probably better that we just take all of them for good measure. You know, you're not gonna be using these anytime soon. I'll just go ahead and keep my hands on them. Thank you so much for your time. <laughs> if we grab all of them, we're sure to get the one we need. <laughs> I mean, I hope. Actually, looking at it, that's the only one that looks different. Principal's office card. All right, perfect. Yeah, you can have the rest. <laughs> you keep the change. Shut up, Isabel. All right, principal's office card. In we go. Look, he's just waiting for us over there. Oh, boy. Principal Eddie. Oh, you must be the one who needed the monster manual. Well, there's only one left in the school. It's hidden in the secret room in the teacher's lounge. Inside to make sure that bad students can't get in. There are three puzzles that you could only know the answer to if you studied your textbooks. Good luck, he says. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> What do you mean, what? No, I, I will get that, okay? I'm gonna get the secret room opened, okay? And I'm gonna take your lovely little, can I have your, yeah, painting remover. Painting? What are we, the whole walls are made of wood, there's no paint. Unless you're talking about something else. Oh, you're not, oh, okay. Well, I guess we should find some paintings then. Well, okay, that's just fine. In the teacher's lounge, apparently, huh? Oh, no. Oh, no, now I gotta remember? No. <laughs> I don't think I remember. Oh, teacher's lounge. Okay, the code should be in here somewhere. Okay, what is the code? It's 64032. Okay, 64032. Pa! Hey, painting, painting, paint, painting. Yeah! Oh, we did it! Nice! Excellent! Oh, wait, we need to study the, the textbooks. Okay. You see, children, this is why knowledge is power, and reading is very important. If it wasn't, well, we wouldn't be doing it. History textbook. Timeline of monster history. In 1794, Knott's created animals and hero Brian. <laughs> well, that's very specific. 1822, first villagers respond. First war of the humans versus monsters. The signing of the peace treaty. A horde of zombies violated treaty back in 1901. 
Wow, there's some serious history of Minecraft I didn't know about. 1902, the second Monsters vs. Humans War, and in 1904, Monsters were victorious, forcing humans to live in small villages in remote areas. So sad, guys. Five likes. But I don't think I caught any numbers out of that. Maybe it's in the English textbook. Easy way to improve your grammar and spelling. Always look up words you don't know so that you can understand them in the future. Never use a word without knowing the true meaning or the false meaning will be ingrained in your brain. Ooh, that, that sounded fun. That rhymed. Also, I think this book misspelled ingrained, which is funny because you're not supposed to use a word without knowing the true meaning. You should probably know how to spell it too. Number three, always count how many spelling errors you make and keep track of that number. That way, next time you can s <gasps> Was the ingrained misspelling on purpose? That way you can compare and see how much you're improving if you follow these steps. Okay, well, so far, none of these have been useful. Math. Basic mathematical operators. Addition. 2 plus 4 equals 6. Yeah, I know. Subtraction. 4 minus 2 is 2. Yeah, I know. Multiplicate 2 plus Yeah, I know. Division 4 plus Nah, I know. Average. Interesting. 4. Number 2. The average is 3. I don't know if I've ever actually used that one before. That's interesting. Isabel, get out of my shot! Tiny games! Ugh. Three days later. Well, okay, we've been through every single room in the entire school so far. I didn't see anything about a new code, so maybe we should just try the old code. 64032. Oh, did that... Did that open it? Oh, you must be joking me the whole time. Come on. Well, whatever. At least we got there, huh? Hey, question one. 20 times 30 and the average of 400 times 4. Oh, my gosh. Do I really have to think right now? I thought this was about the new students. Instead, we had to deal with this? Well, 20 times 30 is 600, and 400 divided by 4 is 100. So 600 and 100 averaged out, I think. So to average it, we add them together. So 600 plus 100 equals 700, and divide that by 2 should be 350. 350. Perfect. Look at that. Question 2. Follow step 3 to complete. Dragon story. Okay. Once. Oh, here it is. Count the errors, baby. Once there was a dragon, that's two, named Eldry. Eldry lived, that's three. Alone, that's four. In a small, that's five. Castle, that was made, that's six. Out of bricks, that's seven. And other, that's seven. I mean, eight. Sub, sub, substances, yeah. <laughs> I'm having trouble reading normally. He kept a huge amount of gold in the castle and spent many hours staring at his treasure. Then he lost at the end. Wow, that's a very sad story. Kind of reminds me of the ugly barnacle. Oh, you've never heard the ugly barnacle. Well, uh, once upon a time, there was an ugly barnacle. He was so ugly that everyone died. The end. Thanks for that, Patrick. It's true OG. And so looking at all this, I counted a grand total of 12 errors. If you want to find the errors for yourself, y'all can pause. One, two. Perfect. We in. Question three. How much time was there between the first monster's war and the violation of the tr Oh, wait. Between the first monsters and the violation of the treaty. Well, let's see. So the first monsters were created in 1794, and the treaty was in 1879. But we actually need the violation date. So that's 1901 and 1794, which is a difference of 107. 107. It's perfect. We've got it. The chest of truth and wonders. Monster manual. <laughs> Tyler, come see me in the classroom, please. Ah, here, O'Brien. Mmm, why'd you create all the monsters anyways? And now you teach students? <laughs> Talk about a great fall. You were much cooler in your heyday here, O'Brien. All right, up we go. I got it right here, baby. What's good? Well, Tally, you spent so much time looking for your textbook that class is already over for the day. Please be prepared next time, all right? You are dismissed. Wait, where's Rex and I? Oh my god! This is not what I had in mind at all. Oh, all the new students, they think I'm a nuisance. Even though they're the ones that caused it. Here, take your books. Nobody wants them anyways. Math, get real. <laughs> Guess we'll hit the school bus for the time being. Ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna do it for today's episode of Monster School by Hanzoid. If you wanna find out more information about my boy Hanzoid, check out the description of today's video. If you wanna see more Monster School on the channel and you wanna see what we get up to in Monster School, then let us know in the comment section below. For now, I'm a ghost, and I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, well, watch me come back to life so I can say smack a like on the video. Thanks for subscribing as well, so you can hit that bell and get notified of every single March School right as it comes out. Like I said, let us know what you want to see us do next in March School. Have a great day. We'll see you later.